Hello, Paul here from EMD Automotive. Today we're doing a uh, making a starter motor cable. All right, this is the old starter motor cable here. I've cut it in the car. I've cut it in the car so I can pull it off the car properly easier. So everything's apart here, as you can see there. But today we're making a new cable. Uh, the biggest, it's the same same kind of size. So this is like a very high high amperage cable as well. This one here, very high amperage cable. Uh, this one we're putting in. But I just want to show you the, the biggest problem they've got is because they go in here and they, they join here, they, they just crimp. There's two two cables going into a uh, sort of like a crimp, crimp connection, like that. See here? It's too. They, over time, they start to actually rust and they start to break down inside and no making, making no contacts. All right, that's the biggest problem they have here. It's this big messy joint here. If they had it separate, if the cable was just separate, like how we're doing it now, separate cable, that's one there. And there's another one here. This one, that's for the actual alternator. And that's for the starter motor. So we're making it separate, and that's why it's not gonna have a massive current draw due to having or sharing a one connection crimp. All right, so after that, once we finish this one here, we're gonna put the extra wire glue put some wire glue inside here before you crimp it and after we crimp it we're going to put the extra insulation the hard plastic insulation which is this part here I'm just going to pull it off there actually it's hard plastic only goes here but I want to go all the way so I'll get my own hard plastic insulation for that for this one here and then my final one will be the little heat shrink that goes over the actual edges like this one here and pretty much that's it because the problem was I had seven volts every time I start the car I've got seven volts at the actual starter motor so after this one here I should get like at least 10.5 9.8 10.5 volts which is normal all right thanks for watching and please subscribe